all of you and uh, I welcome you on your PDA education platform, the platform which is holistically developing technocrat for entire supply chain of the career development. So you people are watching as of now the uh, regular daily updates on group discussion topics and how to proceed forward for GDs. You know the uh, basic philosophy on which we are working here is that GD is very simple. GD is very important for career development whether you are seeking compass placements or you are planning to get into management courses or you are want to get into public sectors or you want to excel later in life. Uh, your skills to discuss in professionally formal settings may, is very important. So how do you discuss with others? That is very important. Number one. Number two, it is not difficult. It is art. It is practice. The moment you do practice, you get that particular skill. Number three, getting job is one part. Growing in job is another part. So those of you who get into NITI, who get into public sector, who get into management courses, if they want to grow further, uh, get promotions, get very good opportunities out otherwise, you need to be really good in group discussions. So there are many things actually which come and your PDA is a platform which provides you opportunity for regular daily GDs, uh, GDs to be conducted with all over in India, people, students from all over India, regular GDs keep on going. All you have to do is you have to show your interest and we proceed forward. Okay, now uh, today's topic is 74th Independence Day. How to initiate? Good morning friends, my name is Vijendra Singh and I introduce you to the topic. Friends, we recently celebrated 74th Independence Day uh, in 2020 and uh, this was a great day for us and uh, we are proud to be Indian and friends, this topic is so general that I am very sure all of you have very relevant points to give and uh, I uh, uh, open, I basically open the discussion by providing the perspective to this general topic. So friends, in our opinion, uh, we recently celebrated 74th Independence Day. We should talk about what are the achievements in all these years for our nation, great nation, and what are, can be the challenges for our nation in future. So what challenges we are facing and what are the achievements we had so far. Largely, we can discuss in these two perspectives. Now friends, I open the house for the discussion and I'm very sure you people will give me where we provide the relevant points for that. So, you have opened a discussion to open a perspective. Now, as you have given a perspective, diya, everybody is falling in line. Everybody will start speaking on this line and actually they are following your agenda. And during the conclusion, you can always then later say, hey, see, this is what I told and this is what we discussed. What can be the achievements? Achievements are, we are the fourth largest economy in the world. We are the fourth largest economy in the world as of now. Second is we are the most successful democracy in the world. All these years for 74 years when we got independence, you know British when they left our nation they showed the apprehension that this nation will survive. Whether this nation will survive or not. But we have survived. All these odds we had some uh, you know, uh, wars with the China, Pakistan and all. So but still we survived. Not only survived, we uh, thrived and we had a very good uh, democratic uh, system here. We have stable government today. We have a very stable government. That is our success. Growth in the field of science and technology. You know, any nation becomes great when its science and technology is great and its economy is great. So our science and technology is really uh, big achievement we have in these fields. If to name space program, defense program, nuclear program, to name some, and technical education in the form of NITs and ISCs and reputed institutes. So we have achieved this. You understand? And now the countries in the international uh, bodies, countries have uh, started accepting India as a leader. You know, G20 nations, you talk about United Nations ke under India ka level, if you see. So those are the things which we have done. Now, what are the challenges? What are the challenges we can understand? And for, for that matter, this achievement part is what we call as India. India is that part which we have achieved. Challenges are still we are Bharat. That Bharat which lives in still rural India. Still rural part of India is that part which is challenge we are facing. 
you know uh, today we talk about human development index social parameters we are poor on social parameters we are still to basically improve our social parameters quality of life of the people quality of life of the people health and education parameters health education parameters where we are today if we talk about poverty illiteracy that is there poverty illiteracy that is still there we have to overcome this kind of problems rich poor divide still we have rich poor divide so friends at the on the eve of 74th independence day we can feel proud to have these achievements but at the same time we cannot be complacent because we have these issues also so i am very open of conclusion kaise karna hai at the end you will say all of us agreed that yes we had many achievements we have come a long way but we have to we have to go a long way so friends when we celebrate 100th independence day in this country you know 2047 that time india should be a great nation all these things should be eradicated and this list should be very very long so we hope india uh, come across all these issues and we have responsibility for that and we pledge today that we will do that and we'll make our nation a great nation so you end it upon that particular thing i hope you understood these topics this is how we have to proceed forward for gds you don't need to have much points but yes whatever points are there they should be convincing points thank you